Right, so today we are back with another Red Dead Online kind of glitch exploit video. And this is highly requested by a bunch of you who have been commenting on my uh, GT Online glitch videos that I should start doing more Red Dead Online again. So here it is, it's a quick and easy Capitale making method. It's not really a glitch, it's more of an exploit, so let's get straight into it. So you need to head over to one of the new opportunities from the Blood Money DLC of course. And all you need to do is be on the part 2 of the Jeb Phelps contract. So over here I'm about to speak to Joe, you want to load up the Blood Money missions. And as you can see, I'm on part 2 of the Jeb Phelps contract. You need to be on this part in order to get the Capitale. So what you want to do is just quickly start that mission. From here, it'll put you in a quick little cutscene where he'll waffle on for about 10 seconds. And then it'll put you into a loading screen. Once you're on that loading screen, it's easy because it'll spawn you close to the objective. Which is in Butcher's Creek. So, what you want to do is head over to this house which we're actually meant to burn down. What we're going to do is not that... We are not burning down this house, we don't want to progress the mission any further than what we are at. So, you want to head over to Butcher's Creek where the objective is, and over here there is two things that you can find. Now one of them is sometimes there will be a tarot card here if you want to quickly pick that up as a part of your collectors. But really the important thing that we come here for is this, climb onto the roof of the house, and over here you'll see this box here, it is a lock box. You open up this lock box and you can get yourself Capitali. Up to 3 Capitali will spawn in this at a time. As you can see I got 3 Capitali this time. Now from here you want to head over to a good distance away from the objective. Now if you don't know what a good distance is just follow what I'm doing on screen right now. Now it's not too far away you just want to get away from the objective so that you can actually uh, leave this objective. So I normally go up to this house here or just a little pass like this and then you want to press pause. Now, once you press pause, you want to go to online, and now you want to just load up crimes or opportunities, it doesn't matter, it'll take you to the same place. And from there, it'll load you back in. Now, from there, all you need to do is repeat this quick and easy method. So, it'll load you back in, you just want to quickly head over to the Blood Money Mission Giver, which gets a number of people. And from there, you just want to start the same contract. So the Job Phelps contract part 2, as you can see, we are still on that. We are still on part 2 because we didn't complete any mission objectives. So, as you can see here, you just want to listen to whoever the mission giver is. Waffle for about 10 seconds. And then it will put you onto a loading screen. And it will spawn you at the exact same spot we spawned last time in Butcher's Creek. And from there, all you need to do... Is head over to the house, pick up the lockbox, and then just ride away a bit until you're away from the objective, and then repeat the glitch over and over again. But it's not really a glitch, it's more of an exploit, but you know what I mean. So you spawn in over here at Butcher's Creek, the same place, so you are very close to the objective, it doesn't take that long to do this at all. Now there is a couple of things that you need to note, that I'm about to show you right now, as soon as we get over to this actual place we need to be. So over here, I'm climbing up here, I'm going to the same lockbox. And over here, what you need to actually take note of is that the amount of Capitali will vary from up to 3. So as you can see, I got 1 this time. So it does vary, but it's still pretty good because Capitali can be traded in for gold and stuff like that. So from here, then you want to go away from the objective once more and repeat by pressing the online pause menu. To just actually go and start up the blood money contract again, the same one, and keep repeating until you are satisfied with the amount of capitali that you actually have from this exploit. And it's pretty easy as that. You just need to rinse and repeat these steps over and over again, and you'll find yourself at the end of the day with loads of capitali that you can trade in for gold and buy whatever you want and stuff like that. It's a very simple and easy and faster method. So if you did enjoy this video, please make sure to drop a like and subscribe for more Red Dead Online and GT Online content. There is definitely more videos like this coming out in the future. And I'll see you all in the next video.